this video, I'll tell you how to get your best personal sniper sensitivity. Let's start by going to settings and finding rotation mode, in this, you'll find fixed speed, distance acceleration, and speed acceleration. Let's start with fixed speed. Fixed speed means that the sensitivity when rotating remains the same despite swapping fast, or slow. Distance acceleration depends on how far you swipe your screen when rotating. Like swiping from this side to this side, is different from swiping from this side to this side. Next up is speed acceleration, this depends on how fast you swipe your screen, for example, if you swipe fast, this moves your screen further, and if you swipe slow, this barely moves your screen. The best out of these three is fixed speed, because this is what most professional players use, and having this turned on, makes your rotation more consistent and helps you to rotate smoothly which fixes your sniper rotation. Next would be turning off link sensitivity with resolution. This means that your sensitivity is being affected by your resolution. The higher the resolution, the faster the sensitivity, and the lower the resolution, the lower the sensitivity. As you can see on the difference, having this turned on ruins your sensitivity so, make sure that you turn this off. Next up is finding sensitivity switch. Sensitivity switch is the switch between different sensitivity like switching from normal sensitivity to scoping sensitivity. And the best out of these three choices is switch while opening ADS, because by turning this on, this will make you change your sensitivity while you are opening ADS or opening scope. This makes focusing your scope on an enemy much easier to do since the sensitivity changes fast and this would be helpful so that your sensitivity immediately changes once you open your ADS which is needed when quick scoping. Next, is setting your sensitivity preset to low before we make it higher. Alright, let's start with the standard sensitivity. This sensitivity is the sensitivity when moving your screen, up, down, left, and right. To get the perfect sensitivity for this, you'd have to be able to swipe 180 degrees like this. If you weren't able to do that, just add more and more to your current sensitivity until you are able to swipe 180 degrees. Next up is the ADS sensitivity. This is the sensitivity when you are moving in scope, and to get it perfectly, is to move 90 degrees from front to the side, and just like from earlier, you just fire it if you weren't able to perfectly swipe to the side. Being able to swipe 90 degrees fast allows you to kill the enemy within seconds and know to react fast. Next would be the sniper scope sensitivity. This is the sensitivity when you are scoping. When using a sniper, to get the perfect sensitivity for this, is to do a 90 degree swap again like from earlier when scoping. Also hit the targets in the training mode until you find the perfect sensitivity that suits best for your sniper scope. For the red dot sensitivity, tactical scope sensitivity, and all the other scope sensitivity, I recommend making it the same as your ADS sensitivity. For me, I got 170 for ADS sensitivity. That means I'll make all of them 170. Or, you could do the same method from earlier. Next is the firing sensitivity. Firing sensitivity is the sensitivity when you are firing. For the standard sensitivity, this is when you are hit firing, you should just minus your normal sensitivity by 40, so, I have 130 on my normal sensitivity, and it'll be 90 on my firing sensitivity. The same as the other sensitivity that you have in your camera sensitivity, just minus it by 40. Next up is going to basics and finding an ADS button for rotation. If you turn this on this would make your ADS button as the button to rotate which could make you slower, meaning you have to turn this off so that you can properly rotate with ease. Next is how you can run faster than your teammates, well, click this video, trust me this makes you run faster.